Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm gonna show you why I'm upgrading from this very basic laser level that I bought a couple years ago on Amazon to a professional one and why you may wanna do the same. All right, let's just start with the unboxing. The people at Dobo sent me this laser level for free. Um, I'm not getting paid, so I'm gonna give my unbiased opinion. For someone that uses laser level often, but it's not like a pro that I needs to use it every single day. Let's just open the box and let's see what's in it. The Dobo laser level comes in this hard case. This, as you can see, it's like really nice and sturdy. Let's just open it and see what's inside. As you can see, it comes in this like very sturdy foam with all the components inside. So let's just start one by one and see what's in the case. The first and the most important thing, it's our laser level. It also comes with a battery charger, two sets of batteries. So one it's in here and one I have already in installed in the base. Also comes with a cable for the charger, a remote, I don't know what this is for, a charger brick. It comes with this mount as well. It also comes with this precision plate and I'll show you how this works just so you can, you can see why this is important. User manual. Scissor lift. This is, this is really funny. I'll show you how this works. And I think that's it. All right, so let's just turn this on for the first time and see how it works. As you can see, it has four levels, one at the top, one on the, one on the front, one on the side, and one at the bottom. Before you turn it on the first time, you're gonna have to insert the battery. The battery slot is back here. You will push it down. It's a little, it's a little stiff, but we'll push it down and then the battery, you'll insert the battery that we, we talk. Just take, it takes one of the batteries and you have another one uh, extra that we have here with the charger. So you can always have uh, one extra battery. Uh, but when I turn it on here, this is what the on position is. And if you can see, I don't know if you can see it on the side, but like these are locked right now. It has a lock and unlock mechanism, which also turns it on. And when it turns it on, like all the levels um, become unlocked. So now they, they move based on the, you know, the position of the level. As you can see there, it moves. Um, this sound that it's making right now, um, so if, if I grab the level and I tilt it, it says it, it's not leveled. And, and because of that, it will beep like that. There's a way, there's a way to disable it and I'll show you right now. But for the most part, if you put it in a, in a flat surface, it will just show the level. So when you turn, when you turn it on the first time, um, you can see there is a horizontal line that goes around my, my garage and if you turn the vertical one, um, it, it shows also the, the vertical. One of the things I want to show you is how bright this laser level is. And for that, I want to compare it to my cheap laser level that I had here at home. Um, so you can see the difference between a professional one and, and a cheap one. All right, so here, here's my crappy Amazon one and I'm gonna put them side by side. This one has like a red light so you can also see the, the, the red light and, and I'm gonna use my, my Dobo with the, with the green light so you can see side by side like how bright or not they are. I just turned some of the lights off and then what you can see is like, here's my, my Dobo laser level and here's my, my crappy Amazon one. Um, so here's the, the difference between the two of them. I'm gonna enable the vertical line as well so you can see, so as you can see, this is my garage. It's very, very dark right now. I just have that main light uh, pointed at us just to, so you can you can see me better. But what I did is like I turn, I turn all the other lights off and I just wanna have the laser levels in so you can see the difference. So. Um, you know, I'm in the middle of the garage right now, and then here are the two laser levels pointing forward. Um, so as you can see in the middle right here, I'm about like three feet away. Um, and you know, the middle is fine. You can see both. And in real life in the camera, I don't know if you can see it in camera, but in real life you can pretty much, they're, they're kind of the same. Now, as soon as we turn, when you go over here, you start seeing the Dover laser level is a lot brighter. Like you can see the red, pretty much fading. And when you get to this point, there's no red anymore. The range of this cheap laser level is about, I don't know, this is probably about six feet uh, that way. And then over this side, you can barely see it. Versus the, the Dovo laser level here is very bright over there. And you go around, it's still bright. It goes all the way. You can see it in the ceiling. 
you can see all the way to that side. That's about like uh, 12, 14 feet. And then, and then you can see it is as bright as it is right here. So um, this laser level is definitely a lot brighter than like your standard cheap um, laser levels. And that is definitely a plus for, for this laser level. Another thing that comes in the box is this clamp. Basically what you can do with this clamp, so you can put the laser level here. Let me show you. And now you can mount this anywhere. Um, it has magnets in the back, so we can use it. We can mount it to any metal surface. Let me see where I have. Okay, I have a metal surface over here. Let's just... Magnets are very, very strong. So if you turn laser level now, let's say we want to install um, some sort of trim or we want to paint. Now we have a line all around the garage. Um, this is very handy for, for stuff like this where you can, you, you would have have to put like a tripod or, or hang it from the ceiling or something like that. But in this case, this adapter is, is really, really nice for that. Another feature of this accessory is this clamps over here where you can unlock this, put any sort of like wood or, or anything that you can, you can clamp it to and then you can press this and it will, it will st it'll stay there. If you want to hang it off a nail or, or a screw in the wall, you can just put it here and, and, and insert it. Um, or if you have one of the tripod heads, the professional tripods, the, the bigger three quarter inch uh, heads, you can, you can also screw it in here. But overall, this, this is very, very useful. Um, as you can see, you can, use it, you can use it without it in a normal tripod scenario, but you can also use this for some other extra applications. The last thing I wanted to show you is this remote. At the beginning, I said I didn't know exactly what it was, but now looking at it, it's not that hard. <laughs> you have a horizontal line where you can turn on and off, um, and you can have the vertical line as well uh, when you turn it on here. Um, the vertical, the, the only thing that I didn't say at the beginning is that verticals, both in the, both in the device and in the remote, it has two verticals. It has the, the one in the front and it has the one in the side. So it's like, you really have three lines. This could be useful when you're like outdoors and then you're far from the, from the level or the level is like in a, um, you know, position where you can't really get to it that easy. So you can turn on and off with this, but otherwise I think for the most part, you're always going to go to the level and, and just like turn on and off the, the different um, the different options. I'm going to show you this accessory that came in the box that is like very interesting. For those scenarios where you just need to like do a minor adjustment on your level, like the high up your level where you want it. So there's, it comes with this scissor lift that is like very tiny. It's a metal, it's a metal scissor lift and look. You turn, you turn this expense and basically allows you to, if you have your laser level on top, allows you to adjust up or down. Just for those those extra adjustments that sometimes you're like put either a piece of paper or something underneath, but in this case, it comes with this really small detail that is, it's great that they thought about little things like this. So it has been a couple of days now and I've used this laser level in a couple of places. One, I was installing wallpaper in the bedroom upstairs and then two, I was installing just like hanging up a mirror. For this type of task, I think having a laser level is really interesting. Now, do you need a professional laser level or you need one of these like cheap Amazon um, laser levels? In my opinion, unless you're doing just very basic stuff, it's really good to have a professional laser level. This one in particular has been really good. Um, I wish I had it a couple of months ago when I built the deck outside. The price on Amazon is about 179. I have a 15% discount code down below if you want to get it. Thank you to the people at Dobo again for sending the laser level for free. Um, and I'll see you in the next video. So the Dobo Professional Laser Level comes in this box. Um, who doesn't love magnets, right? So the people at Dobo send me this laser level for free. Um, I'm not getting paid for it, so I'm gonna give my, my bias, my...
Let's just open the box and let's just walk through the through what's in it. Let's just open the box and let's walk with and let's just see what's in it.